Hello friends, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, I am going to explain about the string relational operators. There are 7 types. Words like any, eq must be used while comparing two strings. These are very easy to remember as these are just the abbreviations of equal to, not equal to, greater than, less than, etc. Use CMP word to compare two strings. It will result in minus 1, 0 or 1 depending on which string is less, greater or equal to. Now let us see some examples. In this program, I am going to explain about the string relational operators. Firstly, equal to. Always remember, we are going to compare these relational operators only with the decision conditioning statement, especially with if. For testing whether two variables are equal to or not, just use eq. I am just trying to print a message here, equal. Test it. Next is not equal to. It should be ne. I am going to change one of the string. Not equal. Next is greater than. Just use the abbreviations greater than. And I am going to change the sequence of the variables. Greater than. Because string 2 is greater than string 1. Now less than. less than. Next is greater than or equal to. For that just use GE which means greater than or equal to. For this I am going to change the variable sequence. Greater than or equal to. Next is less than or equal to. LE L means less than, E means equal to. Just remember the abbreviations. Less than or equal to. The last operator is called the comparison operator. In the numeric relational operators, if you try to remember, the comparison operator is less than, equal to and greater than symbol combined. Now, in string relational operators, the operator which you will be using is CMP. You can just check the result now. For this, I don't need this if condition. Save the result. Now try to print the result. Depending on that you will know which variable is less and which variable is greater. If you can just see here you have got minus 1 which means string 1 is less when compared to string 2. What if you change the sequence? You got here 1 which means this string that means the right hand side variable is less when compared to the left hand side variable. What if both are equal? Same way as we have seen in numeric relational operators the result is going to be 0. 